Excuse me, sir. What time is it? I'm the best at what I do, and that is to test new products to see if they are worth your hard-earned money. Unless you're rich like Elon Musk, welcome back to the channel. It's a friendly neighborhood social media engineer with another exciting unboxing. Today, we're going to take an exclusive look at the Pilata Men's Digital Sports Watch. Wow, you guys are not going to believe the price. The Pilata watch costs under $20. And what's amazing about this? is that it borrows its design from the much more expensive Sunto watch, which costs $100 more. See that? The only major difference is that it has that compass. It's a Sunto down there, where this has a special uh, a diagram along the OTS. All right, so the reason why I decided to buy this watch is because it's looks exactly like a Sunto, which is a lot more expensive. And yes, this is a made in China watch. So don't expect um, the highest quality, but hey, if you guys have $20 and you guys want to look fashionable, why not spend $20 on it? All right, so that's a very simple manual right there. And here is the watch guys. Straight from the box, no fancy packaging. So you can see the band is made out of plastic. Okay, let me just unwrap it right here. Right off the bat, for $20, this looks like a fairly nice watch. It's a somewhat thick watch. As you can see, it has five buttons. We're gonna go into those functions later. On the outside periphery, you have a non-functional compass is just there for looks and I believe that glows in the dark the top two illuminator indicators right there so you see that the outer barrier protects the inside glass from being scratched which is definitely a plus got the OTS logo even this is a Palada brand I don't know what the OTS stands for it's probably some military uh, indicator and on the back you have the stainless steel backing with the four screws, even though so it's water resistant. I looked at some of the reviews, it's a hit or miss. So I wouldn't go diving in it. But for $20, I guess it's worth a risk. All right, so the buns, even though the manual says four buns, I see five buns right here. That being the light and the mode. That's a start stop. That's a lot of lights and that's the adjust. So let's go through all these buttons. Here is the light button. Okay, I need to get somewhere dark to show you guys properly. Okay, there is that glow in the dark. And this is what it looks like in the dark. All right, let's go for the different functions. One press is the stopwatch. Start, stop, reset. Okay. And this is the alarm. I see two indicators down here. You can keep track of two alarms. Okay. And finally, um, so you have to get out of the main, the sub function in order to get the main function to set the clock. So let's go ahead and set the clock and the date and everything. And yes, this has 24 hour military time. Okay, so I've set the time, the date, and also the calendar date. I also set the alarm. Let's see how it sounds like when the alarm goes off. I'm really digging this countdown thing. Looks like a diagram, it's really cool though. Okay, so let me put on the watch while I wait for the alarm to sound. As you can see, it's a plastic band. I have fairly small wrists, so this would probably fit pretty comfortable right here. I just noticed the, OD, the OTS logo on the watch band right there. Okay. Ah, 
That's a nice look right there. See? That's what the alarm sounds like. Fairly alarming. <laughs> Looks great too. Put that. Wow, I like it. I like it a lot. For $18, under $20, you can't beat the design of this. Wow. So many awesome functions. It looks very elegant, similar to a Suunto, and it doesn't get more affordable than this. Now I have to see how long this lasts, but I definitely put, keep you guys updated in the comments section. Yeah, this makes an awesome Christmas present for your loved ones. Go check it out, guys.